All right, welcome to Life at SOK 350. We're gonna be continuing on with Cyberpunk 77 for PlayStation 5. I almost said Night City 2077. <laughs> Anyways, gonna be continuing on with Cyberpunk 2077 PlayStation 5. You already know that we got the 2.0 update, and so yeah, I'm in V's apartment. See if anything changed. Um, but you know, something weird I was thinking about. Remember, I did those Elizabeth uh, Paralysis and Jefferson Paralysis uh, missions, and I know that the um, the ads are on there. You know, we did the story and stuff. So just real quick, I want to look at something because I could have sworn that everything is the same. So if we go to our completed missions. Oh man, this would be back with River Ward and stuff. Let me see what this one is. Evelyn Parker. See, these missions are way out of um out of order. Queen in the Highway Stadium Love following the river. It's a Peter Pan case. I fought the law. Okay, so we did this one, I fought the law, when we looked into why the mayor of Night City died, Lucius Ryan. So if we actually go back to the beginning. Let's see, uh, people. Even this looks different. Okay. Other characters. Alright, story characters. All right, so um, do, 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 do. where is Lucius Ryan? Okay, so Lucius Ryan was the mayor of Night City, right? So uh, he died, um, and so just Jefferson Perales and Elizabeth Perales wanted us to look into it. Now Lucius Ryan was alive, like when the game started, when we went with Jackie to the hotel, and there's still that little bot and everything like that. And before Jackie died, uh, we seen Lucius Ryan in the hotel room uh, because we used the spider bot you could spy on. And then also, um, we know he was alive because River Ward um, came in there and um, took out the Cyber Snyko. I was going to say the Cyber Snyko. <laughs> cyber Psycho that was trying to kill Lucius Ryan. So he took out the Cyber uh, Psycho who was trying to kill him. And uh, that saved his life. So you thought that Lucius Ryan was good. Uh, nope. So then uh, Wilden Holt, who is his assistant mayor, deputy mayor, um, had him taken out by um, basically Lucius Ryan likes to go to a BD club. And he, and he put on a BD wreath and watched his little BD. And this BD club was invitation only. And when he did that, it was right with a virus. And then it killed him. And then, so, Weldon Holt, uh, along with, um, where is River Ward? River Ward's partner, not River Ward, but River Ward's partner, D Detective Han, and all these people involved came up with the idea of, let's take um, Lucius Ryan's body, take it out of the club where he died at, put it in his bed, make it seem like he um, died at home. So, long story short, um, Jefferson and Elizabeth Perales, um, they were the one that was the ones that looked into his murder. They didn't know it was a murder at the time, so his death. And then basically when that happened, that's when we found out all that information. So, and then there was this whole other thing where we found out that they're being like um, brainwashed. They had some satellites set up and their security company, I think it was SSI, were watching them and sending their information to like Maelstrom from like a satellite dish uh, to this van. And then from this van, they were like transmitting like thoughts and memories and stuff uh, to change their mind and to delete memories and make them think a different way, blah, 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 blah. So Elizabeth Perales knew about it. She was scared because she was talking to her husband and her husband um, like couldn't remember things and he was making them new memories and stuff like that. And so she like begged me during a mission to like not tell him what's going on. And instead I did. Uh, I told him the truth and then she blocked me. So I don't even have her as a contact anymore before it said block. 
Um, but that was that mission. That's the mission that started it off. That was the law thing. I fought the law when they wanted me to look into it. And then there was another one after that. Um, let me see. No, that's not it. It's not center, man. Because uh, it's way out of order. Uh, I hate the day. With this 2.0 upgrade, they just uh, messed up everything. They messed up everything. Yeah, because I don't even see... <clears throat> I don't even see the other mission but basically um we were supposed to meet up with um elizabeth Pryor. she begged me not to tell her husband the truth of what's going on and you know basically it seems like somebody tried to kill him uh kill the two paralysis i mean looked like they were going to get to that um but um i guess that's what it felt like to me that's all this brainwashing and and, and watching them and you know, and then they had an intruder in the house that uh, Jefferson Perales had to kill. So basically, like, yada, yada, yada. Like, what does that have to do with anything? Well, when I was doing that other gig mission, um, I think it was the... Um, I think it was the Frolics of the Council Woman or, or something. I'm always checking the computers to see if there's any other um, websites. Let me just close this window real quick because we've got a glare. All right, there we go. And uh, I came on the website of the mayor of Night City. Before it was like, it was Lucius Ryan, it was Weldon Holt, and now it's Jefferson Perales. Isn't that crazy? All right, so look, Jefferson Perales born on July 4th, 2031, Night City. His parents owned a small restaurant, Haywood, despite the family of small wings. Perales claimed he had a, a happy childhood. This year he grew up in, still retains a special place in Sart. A support of his family and innate determination paralysis 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 graduate graduated man this is like i tell you his grammar's terrible paralysis graduated from high school at the top of his class enrolled in the asakuga university in berkeley with the help of scholarship from richard knight foundation he was the fastest student to ever be rewarded a doctorate one of the scholarships of the recipient was Elizabeth, who is his wife, who later became his wife. Okay. After leaving college, Perales worked for several years at renowned Asukuga and Finch Law Firm, while also becoming increasingly engaged in Night City civic life. Soon became the assistant attorney general of Night City before soon assuming the role attorney general. The last few months, Perales has been a member of Night City Council, used his influence campaign against corruption, and improved the basic living standards of Night City's most disadvantaged citizens. And you would see, like, all his his ads and his posters as one of my apartment up to vote for him to be mayor. But look at this. Mayor of Night City since 2077. He said that he was going to go after the people that were messing with him. And then he also said he was going to continue to run for mayor. So I don't know if this is part of the update 2.0 because he wasn't mayor before. I know that. And then office of the mayor, the office of the, the mayor of Night City oversees the treasurer's office, deputy to the mayor, and directs the head of the city departments, including Night City Police Department. Night City system of governance based on the authority of the mayor and co corporation or cooperation with the Night City Council, whose members are elected along neo-democratic lines by the 10 largest corporations headquartered in Night City. Mayor Night City is the city's highest governing representative. He or she has power to appoint apartment heads and commissioners as well as remove public officials from office. Part of the mayor's proposal are subject to approval from the Night City Council with every new mayor comes on office with new faces. Okay, so news. Jefferson Perales becomes mayor. Really weird, isn't it? Okay, Night City has chosen a new mayor. The new, the next Lucius Rhymes is Jefferson Perales. But the next Lucius Rhymes was the Weldon Holt dude, who is this deputy mayor, uh, Lucius Rhymes deputy mayor system. And this is really weird. Like, it's like they're rewriting the story. Like, they just skipped over Weldon Holt. Um, 
who defeated acting mayor Weldon Holt at the voting booth. Okay, they did bring that up. Okay. Weird. When did they have the election? I don't even remember that. Carlos has announced his willingness to cooperate, make corporation hope of raising the living center of all. And then I can't read anymore. I hate when they say read more and you can't read more. Lucius Ryan has passed away with a heavy heart. We announced the unexpected death of Lucius Ryan, the mayor of Night City. Passed away pe peacefully in his own bed. See? They're lying. He didn't peacefully pass away in his own bed. He passed away in the freaking BD club that they spiked with a virus and killed him. Cause of death was coronary implant and function, uh, malfunction. The Ryan family has announced that the funeral will take place on if you try to read it. Of course, it's not going to work. Early mayor elections uh, due to the time of Lucy's Ryan Night City Electoral Commission has announced early elections for the position of nightmare. Two can candidates, well, the whole edge of some prelates have both. And if you try to click it, of course, it doesn't work. They also have that, uh, what's Dark Star? That's a new one. Doesn't work. <sighs> some of these things that they, they have don't work. Easy Estate still works. Oh, I wanted to look at this. So we got, we have all the apartments now. We have North Side rented. We have uh, Japantown is rented. We have a Corporal Plaza rented. And we have the Glen. But the cool thing about it is we can make over our current apartment. Any questions? Contact us. It looks like some QR code. So we can change it to the Cardinado Twilight for 10,000 eddies. Or we could change it to the Lunar Tranquility. Or we could do the California Max. Or the Neon Sands. Let me do the Coronado Twilight. Let me see what that looks like. Alright. And then they're loading it up. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, nice. Let me open the window real quick. It really makes a difference. Okay. This is the Cardinado <clears throat> Twilight. Looks like a lot of gold. Okay. Let's look how the stash room looks. Stash room still looks the same. No change there. What's up, kitty? All right. Shower, toilet, okay. And then the bed, okay. All right, let's look at the next one. Let's see, easy estates, and we will do the makeovers and the lunar tranquility, okay. Select and select. All right, yeah. This one looks space-like. I like this one better. I don't know why. It seems like I don't. Just my opinion. Like when they have like something that's all white. You know what they say? It gives the illusion of it being bigger. Versus with dark colors, they say it looks smaller. They do have a point because with that gold, it did look like it was smaller, but this actually makes it look more, more bigger. Okay. Okay, okay even the bed changes. Floor. Dash room, I don't think it's gonna change. Yeah, it's still the same. Okay. Alright, and then we will do the easy estates. 
Doesn't sound like somebody's walking around in my apartment. Makeovers and a California Max. That's 10,000 eddies. Man, when you got money to burn, I would never think of doing this in the last, uh, before the last update because in this update, I definitely have more money. Easy to make money. Okay. So this is the California one. Uh, this one is ugly. I know it's for somebody, but it's not for me. And so it's like a bad 70s, uh, 1970s apartment or something. Or somebody who likes to drive a school bus, but wanted to decorate the house as such. Even the bed changes uh, the sheets and blankets and stuff. And of course the toilet changes, the sink and stuff. Look at that. Wow. So it's basically changing out the skins. Okay, we got one more. Right, easy estates, and then we have the <clears throat> makeovers, neon sands. Okay, uh -huh. they had a cat right there. This cat is just going off. All right, this is neon sands. Ugh. Man, this is ugly. See the floor here, the ceiling. Blankets the same. Dash room is the same. Okay. Okay. The shower head change. All right, I'm gonna go back with the lunar one. That's the one that I like. Easy estates and uh, makeovers. The Lunar Tranquility. Oh, 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 wait. There's some more at the bottom. Flamingo City. Boy, I'm gonna spend all my money on this. Oh, no. I can tell you right now, I'm not gonna like this one. Oh, man. Yeah, this looks like some body who really loves Florida. And they just wanted to have the Florida colors in there. You know, that's the actual thing. Like when you're getting your house painted, especially if you're like getting it built, and then you could pick the Florida colors. Or sometimes houses will be painted what they call the Florida colors. Which what I've seen is just, it could be like green and blue, and I guess green to be like grass or palm trees. The blue to be like water. Okay, the rug changed too. Whoa. I never even went into the toilet since I've been here. <laughs> That's crazy. And then, um, yeah. I've seen one where it had like pink salmon. I don't know what the pink is for. I guess for flamingos like they have here. Okay, and the last one is going to be Soul Bread Tiger. Okay. This guy just made a cool, what is it, 60,000 easily for me. Okay. It's a Soul Bread Tiger. Absolutely ugly. Hey, V, do some laundry or something. 
clean up this place. I see the ceiling there. Get a blanket then change though. Okay, the carpet change. Toilet changed. Stash room is still the same. Alright, I'm gonna change it to that lunar thing. That's the one I like. Easy estates, makeovers, lunar tranquility. Oh, I gotta. Oh, every time I change it, I gotta pay. Oh my god. Alright, so if you wanna keep it on something, I would really say that. Like maybe the one that you end up liking, like to do that one last because man, it's like every time you change the skin, you gotta pay. It's not like it's own, like you buy the apartments and you own it and then you can just change it. What the hell, why would they do that? Like people got money to burn like that. It means they gotta work again, make more money. Yeah, the stash room always stays the same. Yeah, I like this Lunar Tranquility, this is cool. It'll be hard to keep clean, though, if you ask me, but... Okay, see, even the blanket and she's changed. And it's the dream catcher that uh, Jackie's girlfriend gave me. When I finished the, um, that Zodiac card mission. Okay. See, even the shower head changes and the toilet does too okay cool all right so enough of that i'm gonna spend a lot of money look 79,902 eddies i had like close to 130 or something 120 all right let me catch you up on my character v level 35 50 street cred i know this outfit looks really crazy but you know whatever um, I got my, uh, Jackie's pistol. I put a silencer on there. I was using that for that last mission. Comrade's hammer. No need to have introduction for this one. Got this one. I was in the level 20s. I, um, crafted this weapon. It was, uh, epic iconic or rare iconic, something like that. And before they did the upgrade to 2.0, I was waiting to get technical ability 18 so I could craft the legendary items, and I was gonna craft the legendary item uh, version of this, but it looks like, if I'm not wrong, um, I don't know if tier five is equal to legendary, but a lot of my weapons got upgraded automatically, so I don't worry about that anymore. And so R22. So here's my clothes that I have on right now, and it's weird because it doesn't really. Some of these don't say anything. Like, see, this one says plus. 13 0.13 weapon zoom but some of these don't say anything this is the head stuff that i have this is the eye stuff that i have upper body stuff that i have uh clothing that i have okay and boots that i have i kind of want to change my clothes i don't know i'm just not digging this outfit and this is me, how I currently look. Got the classic hair going on. I look like a Oompa Loompa from Charlie uh, in the Chocolate Factory. Okay, so I'm going to put on this reinforced breathable dress shirt. will offer a sense of professional stoicism, if not for the tie. Okay, I already put on this one before. I think. Did I have this one on before? Or did I have this one on before? I don't know, but this one's legendary, so maybe I do a legendary build. Why she had the collar up? The collar's down on this one though, and this one says uh, Paris blue office shirt. Remember when we do that, then it brings up a smaller version of it, so you can rotate. Paris blue office shirt invest with reinforced seams, crafted from genuine bio silk. Okay, and we're gonna do the pants. We'll just do the legendary pants that we have. Black pants. It's really like the few black pants that I have. 
Um, for the face or head. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do anything. For the face. Let me see this one again. Yeah, this one looks crazy. I mean, this matches the tie. Go as a mouse drummer for Halloween this year. <laughs> Definitely does. All right, let me change that. Put the glasses on with that. Technical hybrid glass, corporate glasses. So Lisa looks like I'm halfway <clears throat> legendary everything. Um, these are only boots that I have. Nah, we ain't gonna go with that. We're gonna just go barefoot. <laughs> so that's what I have. Okay. All right. So do 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 do. My cyber deck needs no introduction. And that watch net driver MK1 tier five iconic. Uh, before the upgrade, this was the net watch net driver MK4, and it was a legendary cyber deck. I think it's still legendary. I think it had eleven eight six or eleven six something like that. But basically, had eleven RAM and six slots. But it um it upgraded, so now it's got thirteen RAM and eight slots. So I'm happy for that. Overheat tier five, suicide tier four, cyber cycles tier four, short circuit tier five, snaps burnout tier five, pain tier five, contagion tier four, and cis class tier five. Here's the other things that I have. You see the RAM cost is not that bad. Look at this cyber psychosis though it can be kind of pricey. Especially this one and let's see where is suicide at. Suicide is pricey too. Alright, so we got mono wire right now. Um so currently my cyber capacity is 131 out of 131. Still waiting to get the just trying to give you hints. The Edge Runner and Resistance Punk. So I can open up more things. Um, the armor is 238 out of 1129. Both of those got upgraded uh, with the patch. For the frontal cortex, you see now when we click on it, we can go from each body part. The frontal cortex, self ice, and Metatronic Core. Everything is pretty much tier 4. My cyber deck, of course, is tier five. I already went over that one. Arms, mono wire, tier four, and I also have the project that launch system. Face, Groshi, Sentry, Optics, uh, Titanium Bones. You know what I'm gonna do? I need to go to Ripper Dog, and I need to change that. I want to see if the project that launch system has changed. But Groshi, Sentry, Optics, tier five. The Titanium Bones, tier four. Smart Link, tier five. Current Zikov tier 4 plus, circulatory system, blood pump, and the biomonitor tier 4. Integral system, I got the nano plating tier 4 plus, optical camo tier 4 plus, and the thermal armor tier 4 plus. Legs, I don't have anything. Still trying to figure out what to do about legs. Uh, with the max docks, it's not like before I had hundreds. Uh, this gives you two. It seems like if I use them, then they just come back, regenerate later. Makes it really hard to heal yourself uh, if you use them fast. Um, bounce back, and I got the blood pump. Guess I can always switch to that. The grenades, it's not unlimited grenades like before. Or how a craft like hundreds, they have a cap on them. So I guess you use two, and then, you know, it regenerates. Um, bat pick. So these are the uh, tier 5 weapons that I have. Some of these I found. Some of these have been upgraded. Like I found this one. This one I already had. This one I already had. This one I already had. And Jackie's Pistol. Um, the Liberty I already had. The M-10AF. This was already legendary. got this from either one of those NCPD missions or something. Or it was a drop or during one of the side gigs. Maybe Cyber Psycho. I don't remember. Um, this Nico Mata, that was from one of the Cyber Psychos. That was Epic 2. Um, the New A Tier 5, this is all legendary. So basically, all these guns, 
except for the Lexington uh, M-10 AF Lexington were all epic. And so with the 2.0 upgrade, I don't know, it just upgraded them all to tier 5. Um, so I'll take it. I'm not going to complain. And my SOR. Uh, yep. Okay. So, so that's that. So that's what I have. I still got this weird thing that I got from the Delamain headquarters. That's not showing up. I don't know what it is. Even before the 2.0 patch, you didn't fix it. So no description and no weapon. These are the tier five uh, melee weapons that I have. I had that katana that I got from the cyber psycho. I don't know what happened to that. It kind of looks like this one, I think the tier four plus. Um, but either way it got downgraded or something. The scalpel that I had, I got from the side mission where I saved that uh, Japanese uh, surgeon um, for that guy in Afterlife. I have that. That was rare, or excuse me, epic, and this one got upgraded to tier 5, so I don't know what's going on here. So those are things I have. Clothing, this is what I have. I have a lot of things that are legendary or what do you call it, tier 5. That wasn't tier 5 before. It's a lot easier to get uh, legendary stuff, whereas before it was hard to get it. Uh, so let me have her eat something. And grenades. And there's my testament of mods. They gave me a lot of these. So after 2.0 upgrade, I have a lot. Because I used to hate this Kimlet thing. But look how much you can sell it for now. 278 where it was like 13 bucks before. Got a new scope there. And then the junk. I can't really show you the junk because I don't see it. Story stuff or game stuff. Got bar my cyber deck. Still have all Jackie's keys. Key to motorcycle. Key to other things. Saburo's dog tag. Saburo's data bank. Um, stuff like that. Other stuff I have in the stash. Backpack crafting. They don't have crafting levels anymore because I was 11 before the patch. Can't craft... Um, Health items and can't craft grenades. Upgrades, I can only upgrade really the guns that I have. And I don't have sufficient components. And even if I do upgrade it, it will upgrade it to a tier 5 plus, And I don't know what that does. And I don't know if there's a tier 6 or something. No idea. Uh, what else? What else? Stats. I have been playing for a total of 120 hours and 14 minutes. Corporal V, female V. There's my damage, armor, health, other. 50 street cred, 35, which you already know. Here's my perk attribute tree, body 10. These are the perks I have. Okay. And we could just cycle through instead of like clicking on it and then going back. I don't know if I really like this new system. I know some people are going to like it. Some people are not. But I kind of like the old system. Yeah, there's some things I would have reworked. But I kind of feel like I lost a lot of things. Like I used to have it when I was hacking the access points. I would get quick hacks. Legendary quick hacks. Or other kinds of things. But now, I don't know. All the perks and stuff that I had set. Because I have like close to 50 perks um set and now i can only set what they have now so i think for a new player this would be good because you don't really know how the old system works but for people that are coming from the old system this could be kind of annoying and i'm over here watching little china um in v's apartment i got a type day 66 640 ts vehicle from dino because i just finished a lot of his gigs and because i finished them um, the last one, guess, 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 where he gave me the um, car for finishing his gigs. So for the all the missions that are available, the Rayfield Caliburn, I already have one. But Dino wants to sell me one. You can buy it down on street talking more automatic love with Judy on hold until the Phantom of Liberty DLC comes out, Um, I think, next week. Yeah, I already bought it. Just wait for it to open. Beat on the back Kabuki. I tried to do that. You pay 8,000 eddies. You try to fight both of them. Or you could pay 4,000 eddies. I did 8,000. I lost. Lost 8,000 eddies. And I was like, screw this. I don't have money to burn. Um, so there's other beat on the back ones. I didn't know you had to pay to to fight them. So that's weird. 
The gigs, uh, guinea pigs. I don't know why this came up again. I already finished this already. Um, in my completed missions, but after the 2.0 update, it said it was failed and it put it right back into my mission. So I don't know what's going on with that. And then when I try to go to the map to see where this is at, I can't find it. So, so if I go, see, I can't even track it. See, it's weird. So I'm thinking that there's something wrong with this. Because then it goes to beat on the brat and that's not the one. So let's see. Where am I? I am here. Let's see what other gigs are available. Here's another one over here. Gun for hire. Neutralize the target. It might be that one. So let's go see. Let me check my recording time. Okay. Got plenty of time. All right. Oh, 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 the attic. Oh. No, this is sell. Do I want to sell anything? I don't think I have stuff to sell. Nah, I think I've sold everything. They still got this uh, cyber psycho here. I wonder if you can um help him out. I was trying to figure out if you could help this tiger claw. Dead anyway. It's like as long as you go into your apartment, then you don't get to want and love one anymore. Whereas in Grand Theft Auto, if you do that, <clears throat> they'll still come after you. They shot somebody innocent. It's a police officer. Some dude that he shot. The cut Tiger Claw guy, I guess he shot him automatically. They didn't get any extra points for like punching her. Okay. Alright, let's go over her. Not there. Alright, so select destination. We're gonna do the Allen Street South. I thought I finished all of Dino's gigs, but maybe not. Since there's more available, or maybe he has more available, or maybe you have like a certain number you have to finish, and then you just get the reward. Jotaro oh, Regina Shoko. Jones. Ring a bell. Oh, this Guy's is a her key. Psychopath. Records himself torturing joy toys and sells that shit to like-minded scumbags. The mocks finally tracked him down. This is your chance to give this fucker what he deserves and earn a little scratch while you're at it. More on this sicko attached. Okay, all right, let me um, hack this real quick. All right, so we got a 7A 1C55. Let's try 7A 1C55. And then we can do an E9 and then we come back and do a 7A. Okay, perfect tool. Okay, so let's read her thing. Alright, Regina Jones, help the mocks, help the world. Okay, so this is what the guy looks like. So the target is Jotaro Shobo, location the Ho-Oh Club on Allen Street. Details feel like 
doing everyone a favor, making Eddie's doing it. Deal with your Taro Shobo. Twisted MF like no other. He's Tiger Claws to this scumbag who's got a thing for scrolling. XBDs. Who's to say whether he just gets carried away or, and my money's on this, he gets off on tortured screams of his victims. Best guess is 17 murders to his name, but the injustice for the streets, dead and missing joy toys is notorious. But the Moxies are different. Mox net runners connect a few dots and track downs to Toro Studio Ho-Oh with a, a quaint little club in Kabuki. This area is a no-go for Moxes, which is why they need a helping hand. Find this effort, Jotaro, and tell him his days in the entertainment biz are done. Okay. So, this is a... This is the thing that kind of makes me really wonder, like, am I supposed to kill him? Or I'm supposed to scare him? I don't know. Alright, so he, I guess, is part of the Tiger Claws. This is Ho Oh. This kabuki based casino run by the Tiger Claws. Ground floor is only space accessible to customers, while the rest is occupied by gang operations. If you ever need to get up from blackjack games, stretch your legs, think twice before heading upstairs. Jotoro Shobo. Night City had a contest for the most rotten to core piece of human garbage. Jotoro Shobo. Shoba or Shobo. Uh, would stand for any decent chance for winning, of winning, maybe not first place, but he'd definitely be up there. He got a nice suit, though, I like that. Jotaro is a high-ranking Tiger Claws ganger who, thanks to his intelligence, loyalty, and ruthlessness, quickly made his way up to pecking order. He, he rules the his lackeys with an iron fist and is never late with his cut for the bosses, who repay him for protection and turn a lot into his various hobbies. I wonder if his bosses are part of the NCPD or other people, like politicians and stuff, too. One of them includes recording brain dances, and one's, anyone who's relived them calls him the devil of Kabuki. So he's probably, like, torturing and killing people and recording it and selling them as BDs. Sicko. Okay, and we all know Regina Jones, who's trying to bring in all the cyber psychos, get them re rehabilitated. She was on that uh, psycho killer mission where we had to find and capacity all the cyber cycles which I already did so maybe that's in relation to this since I finished that and that's it we are over here in Watson Kabuki let's go get this guy okay. gave me a lot of uh, components save It's a quick catch thing here. Guess I can't jump up there. Couldn't it? Zero must not be that good. Okay. It must be really easy now. We need to do a 1C and then a 1... Uh, and then a 1C and then a 1C. Okay? Easiest pie. Don't know why they got a camera there though. Yeah, they got a Bombus drone here. I let him do the heavy lifting for me. Let him do cyber psychosis and then hide. He goes in and kills his people.
You don't need no cups. I am the cups. Okay, that did not work out, bro. Get a contagion on them. Got three of them now. Look at that. And let's do the I uh, can't do anymore. Two quick hacks here. Nice. Over here. Let's see if we can get two or just one. That'll let us know how many people there are up there. So it's just one lady. As she said. Alright, let's check in. She protect me while I'm checking in. 7A. And then a 55, and then a. S oh boy. Yes. 7A, and then a 7A. Cool. Alright, so we need to do a E9, and then a 1C. E9, 1C. So we just need to leave the area real quick. <laughs> See, it's the thing that kills me, right? I'm still in combat somehow. Look at these people, net runners. Oh crap! I'll be so screwed. And they got skulls on their heads. You see, PD's net runners. Like it's supposed to reset, so I can save, but of course it doesn't. Still puts me in combat. I'm even trying. Why are the kids over here playing? Can't go in that door. <clears throat> it's like that's the only way that we can go. Okay. Oh shoot, man. Ooh. Dude, that was a hell of a surprise. Man, come on. Trying to give me a heart attack. I got him.
Oh, you can go in here too. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm carrying too much. Come on! Consumables. I need to get some capacity, but oh my god, I'm gonna die. I can't do this right now. You gotta be kidding me. Out of all... You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Let's go by quality. I'm gonna have to just break these things down. Uh, is this RT Borea? New way. I already have one of these. Get rid of that. That's my weight now. 405. Exactly the same now. Get rid of D5 copper heads. And now we should be able to use it. Or is it because I'm in combat? Yep. What is with this game? Like, I can't get out of combat. I'm gonna go that way. I thought about they all geometric patterns. Subtle accessories, not too many. Usually monochrome or like two, three colors max. Less is more, right? That's what neo militarism is all about. Mm hmm, exactly. Like Jinguti clean lines, pencil skirts, asymmetrical jackets. Got some preem knockoffs down at the market. Saw them myself. Yeah, so did I. But the quality, girl, nothing like the originals. They practically glow. True, true. But if you can't have what you want, better start one what you have. Took the words right out of my mouth, girl. And besides, a real woman can look preem on any budget. Okay, and a real woman uh, can get out of combat by running all the way down the street. This is so ridiculous. I don't know if this, this update did that or not, but look at this. How I'm still in combat and I'm so far away. Oh my god, really? 25 Netrunner. Okay, now I can take the thing. This is so stupid, I tell you. Alright, give me more capacity. And then they're saying that my... I don't see any perk things. I don't know what they're talking about. Alright, now we can... Oh. I don't even remember what I was... Which one is which. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's go get this Jotaro guy. Ooh, got 4,280. <laughs> Poison me. Dang, man, I can't even walk, run and pass him. Oh, yeah, this is definitely Kabuki. All right, so this is the casino. Man, that's a short skirt. Rain dance available titles. What's the titles? Body horror 12, first and last time. Acrophobia unleash. Oof. No thanks. My big fat chrome body. Welcome to Hell 2. Ride it live. Golden shot 4. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
How much you lose recently? Not much. A watch, a couple of implants, my apartment. Wow. What? Hey, hey, relax. I'm gonna get it back. As in today, if you can spot me. Nuh uh, forget it. Damn, he's really addicted to the gamma. Fuck it. Nothing even matters. Okay. Dude, do you know how dirty this toilet is? It's not in the toilet, obviously, the hacking thing. He's technically <gasps> I think that leads to outside. Okay, let's do a E91C55. E91C, which 55 though? 557A. 7A. And then we can do a 1C. I don't see an E9 though. 1C, 1C, E9, there we go. Alright. And like I said, I think this leads to outside. Okay, so here's another way that you can come in. Alright, cool. That's a side little door there. On my way. Okay, that doesn't open. I think I see the dude moving. We can use technical ability to open this one. So I'm like, it's a apartment? What? what? Okay, he might be in there. Okay. I'm going to have to stop the video here because I'm about to run out of time, but we will continue this next time.